How you doing guys and welcome, it is Kraken here and we're back on day 46 of Ravenhurst. So we got back at a decent time yesterday so I managed to get quite a bit done overnight. I've got loads and loads, there it is 4 o'clock in the morning, loads and loads of water production on the go. We put our propane tank into this bad boy here, our recycler, and this is actually doing a lot for me. I had so much I've been lobbing in there, like old tools and things like that. They were actually doing pretty well. I'm going to take that iron out of there. I made myself two new cabinets over here. So this one is for all my iron, which we're going to need for upgrading. And this one is for my stone, which is very nice. Um, this one is finished doing all of what it needs to do at the moment. We've got 5,000 stone in there, so we're going to actually... Yeah, we'll get some cement on the craft. Because there's no reason why not. So we build that up. We've actually got ourselves up to 115 steel with all the steel that we've been um, taking, which is nice. And we've got quite a bit of cement here. Cobblestone... Uh, cobblestone we've got in both of you. There we go. In fact, we leave all the cobblestone there. So we've actually got just over a thousand cobblestone, which is nice. Um, I'm going to quickly boil up some eggs. Uh, no, we've got a little bit of time on them. The first thing I need to do today, though, is... In fact, we will start boiling up those eggs now. Um, as we've got the water here to do it. Um, first thing I'm going to need to do today is I'm running really low on honey and really low on wood. And obviously it's going to take a lot of wood to do the upgrading that we need. So let's get some boiled eggs on the craft in here. Fantastic. I'll drink one of those. So the first thing what we're going to do is become a lumberjack and cut down a load of trees. So let's get cracking. Right, you didn't see anything, buddy boy. Right, another whisperer there. I've actually changed my mind. Um, we are going to do the tree chopping, but first of all, we're going to go and do Claudia's treasure map, which is just the other side of town, and see what good stuff we actually get from that, because I do need clay soil as well, because we're using all of it to make bricks. Um, so we may as well do that, and I like the trees around, around my house, so I'm going to chop down trees once I've grabbed her treasure so that is going to be the next thing we are going to do right here we go we've got a nice tree in the way for us as it is anyway so that'll get us there we go we've got some honey and stuff from that and let's get to z digging oh i did make myself another pipe weapon here as well so we now have two so if we do get ourselves into a bit of trouble we've now got 30 bullets rather than just the 15 so I'm going to try and use them a bit more because, like I say, I do want my um, my skill to go up in that. Because at the moment, my skill in automatic weapons is extremely, extremely low. And we're going to get to a point soon where we can't actually use just melee. It is going to be... We're going to have to start using guns. And at the moment, I, that's the best I can do is a 120 pipe machine gun which is um for the use of a better word bollocks right there we go found the treasure it didn't took us a little bit of time but i didn't actually mind too much because i wanted as much of the clay soil as i could get we're actually very close to one shot in this there's only 10 health left on the soil there we go half out of the do for what's it out of the circle right five thousand hit points Right, what have we got? Nine seconds. At least we're getting lots of these decent um, sized chests now. Finding much better stuff in them. Okay, oh, look at that. 8,000 jukes, lovely jubbly. Got quite a bit of this 5.56 five, ammo now, so more 7.62. Yeah, happy with that. Happy with that. I don't know. Yeah, there's nothing I can actually do with these um, these gold ones. So quite happy to sell them to the trader and get ourselves even more money. Right. Lumberjack time. 
Right, from this bag here, two levels in athletics, okay. Well, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Right, get a few more of these. Uh, Jarvis over there as well. Right, it's 880. Are the logs that we can put into the... Um, into the table saw. Right, I'll try and take that up to a thousand. I'm getting a few bees and stuff as well. Um, both of my beehives are actually um, ready to be ready to be done now. Woohoo! Do you remember back in the day when the fire axe was the most powerful weapon in the game for the early days? The good old days, eh? The good old days. Right, I need to go back and eat some food as well. So I'll go back. There we go. One more tree and we'll all be good. And then we'll go and hit up that um, other tier three. Tier four, whichever it is. You know, tier three quest for the trader. Sell a load of this stuff to him as well. This is the only problem with him respawning once every seven days. And we've got so much money. Yeah, because I haven't really got any room on me. 700 meters away so he is closer to my base so yeah i'll go and get this onto the table saw start making some normal planks eat some food there we go there's another egg for me and then we'll get off and we'll do that um tier three quest right here we go we've actually had an airdrop come in as well so we'll go and grab that straight afterwards food and water is all sorted the Gully's Residence. I don't recognise this one at the moment. Could be something that we've seen before. Maybe not. Okay. Short iron pipe. We've actually got just under 10,000 iron now, which is pretty damn good going. Now, what's going to be difficult is our mining skill is getting up there nicely. But the problem we've got is that we're not going to be able to actually make the steel to make steel tools. Oh, lovely cement as well. Definitely going to help us out. Lady Lumberjack. I'm biker, how are you doing? There's a fetch, yeah, it's a fetch and clear, which is good. I'm not sure, have we found that book? No, I don't think we have. Weapons pile. Burning shaft mod, okay. Now, one thing I did actually realise um, is we can't actually make a wrench. We haven't unlocked it. Which is a little bit of a pain, because I actually scrapped one the other day. I put it into my recycler, and I haven't really got any spare. And I wouldn't mind taking a few of these apart to get the spare forged iron and stuff. But I don't think I can make a crowbar either. Yeah, wrench is um, still there. Uh, no, you can't make crowbars. So... I want to be a little bit careful with that actually, so I'm gonna have to um try and um try and keep an eye on that. Um how close are we actually? Salvage tools. Oh, that unlocks a wrench actually. There we go. Ignore me. We can now do it. Cool, that must have hurt. Yeah, not too clear. Whoa, whoa, easy tiger. Get out of here. Stuck by in the bin, were you? Put them into my recycler. The recycler is still... It's been nearly two days of just getting me iron. Really nice. Really, really nice. Cheeky spider zombie. Bloody thing. 
Ugly shirt. Scrap that. Ooh. Backpack. Uh, medical. So we can make plaster casts. Right, okay. Right, take a bit of this apart because I've just made myself a new pickaxe. And that used up some twine and stuff. There we go, fell white sorted. Right, I do want that. Thank you. Right, so it's going to be somewhere on this level where it looks like we're going out. Come back in. Bloody vultures. Walk a shame, how are you doing? And Loza, how are you doing? Right, there we go. Found the supplies and we've got one area left to clear, which will probably be the final loot area. Here we go. Right, Feral White and Walker Shame. dodgy coloured loza oh fantastic glancing blow claiming absolutely crunch there right a cooking pot mine right let me get this opened up for us we've got a few chemistry station things up here as well and a cracker book very nice and the rest of the loot is up there in fact we'll just do it now actually chemistration come on give me a beaker you bastard. You utter bastard. Blue. Don't mind that, but it's not really what I want. Nitrate. We've got so much nitrate now we can do that new trick. It's untrue. Soda. Take you straight away. Weapons pile. Not really much in there. Not a lot at all. I'm putting the buckshot. Oh, there we go. Sweet as another skill point. Okay, read that one, read that one, and read that one. I do like the crack but ones. I've been putting the buckshot into the recycler actually just to get myself some free lead. Right, weapons bag. Oh, we got a popping pills crate here. Okay. Very, very useful if it gives me a beaker. Some more steel, very nice. Right, rip you off. Come on, give me a beaker. Gotta be a beaker, gotta be a beaker. You bastard. Right, what are we gonna get from the big chest then? Got another mining skill there for knocking this one open, which is very, very nice. Like I say, the next thing we, go, we get, we open. Oh, very nice. Okay, so we can read you straight away. Very, very nice. Some lock picks. The chain mod might actually be better for me, to be honest. Because it does have a greater chance of knocking people down. So 50-50. It's a shame you can't put both of them in. Because that would be very nice if we could. But, um, right. Go and hand this into the trader. But before we do that, get out of it, you. Before we do that, we're going to go and get this this airdrop because it's um yeah a couple hundred meters over there right right next to the old cracker book actually there we go Loza. old lumberjack i missed you Fantastic. Oh, I can't believe how difficult these were right at the beginning of the game, doing these airdrops. 
Especially when I ran away from it the first time to kill all the zombies, not realising that you had to stay in the area. Lovely. I can't remember if we had the gloves or not. Some more money. Vegetable stew. I'm going to actually keep him for the second. Um, and I'll keep that one just for the second as well, actually. Right, very nice, very nice. Right, to the trailer, which is again, just a couple hundred meters away. What a busy day. Are you gonna purchase something? I don't care what folks say about you in the wasteland. You're almost okay in my book. Right. <sighs> AK-47. Crafting... Um, skill magazines or more forged steel. That's quite a difficult one because that's a half decent AK there actually. It's only 196. For me, that's that's a good level. If I can hear somebody, I think that's about to come and hit me in the head. Uh, we've got to sell you some stuff anyway. So let's quickly do that first. Right, that's giving me some spare room. Let's just quickly open that. Southern farming and some more home cooking. Right, that's giving me a little bit not more space. Bad. Yeah, what should we but go for? Great. Just don't let this go to your head. We're so far away from making steel, but that would let me upgrade another two blocks. But then the AK could come in useful. But then I have got two pipe machine guns, which holds the same amount of bullets as one AK. So I could just stick to the pipe weapons. But the magazines would be really useful as well. Um, this time I'm going to go for the magazines. Because we've got lots of things here. Uninhabited mansion. Fetch and clear. Fantastic. Let me just quickly open this one up and see what we get. Ah, that's what I wanted. Armour. Fortunately, didn't give me anything else. I thought you gave me three magazines. You only gave me two, you miserable, miserable bastard. Okay, well, we've got another job to do tomorrow. Oh, we did actually go... Oh, we got landmines. Right, well, that's why I'm going to leave this episode, guys. I'm just going to go home and put everything away. That's all I ever seem to be doing at the moment, is putting a lot of shit away. Like I say, all these episodes are going to be quite short because we are having to spend half the day either mining or chopping trees down or doing something. But we do have another treasure map to do tomorrow. Um, we might do that quest tomorrow or we might get on with actually trying to get this base sorted. Because that is going to be, that is going to be quite a thing. We do need to get on and get that done. There we go. Found a little bit more gas. And let's pick up all the stuff that's in you. Fantastic. Guys, as always, big thumbs up on the episode. You guys have a cracking day. Look after yourselves and I'll catch you in the next episode. Take it easy.